how I achieved this color on my raw Vietnamese bundles. So this was my daughter's back to school hairdo. Um, as you guys have already seen this video, but I've gotten quite a few questions in regards to where did I purchase this hair. I sell hair. I make wigs. Um, so if you're interested in purchasing hair for me, you can purchase hair via the link in my bio on IG. Um, as well, if you wanted to purchase order wigs, that information is on my IG hair page, which is linked also in my bio on TikTok. Um, but nonetheless, this is my raw Vietnamese hair. What I did was use uh, three to four or five boxes of Prima Nature Honey Blonde to achieve this color um, on the Vietnamese raw hair. So the hair did not come in the color that you see my daughter wearing. I colored it, custom colored it myself um, using a box dye. Um, and this is the process of what I did. Basically, I went through and saturated the hair thoroughly. I even took the bundles uh, loose. I cut the little clips that comes on the raw hair, cut the clips off, separated it, and literally thoroughly saturated. Like I wanted to be thoroughly saturated because I see when people color hair, there's an inconsistency in the color, which I personally, um, I have a little OCD and perfectionism when it comes to hair. Um, so imperfection in color is an issue because you have some pieces that are lighter and darker, especially when you do watercolor, which is why I kind of um, moved away from doing watercolor because the hair color fades over time. Yes. And then on top of that, um, it, there, it'd be light and dark inconsistency and once you put heat on watercolor you will see that there's a difference as well so we went the permanent route with the honey blonde um like i said i used literally probably two bottles per bundle she had three bundles of 24 inch raw vietnamese hair so what i did was pretty much take it loose baby i want all the dye out of the bottle okay i want every last drop because i paid for it because i want all of it and i literally ran, ran my hands through it pulled it through saturated the wealth um so that i can make sure that the color got through thoroughly to every strand of the house so it wouldn't be no light and dark inconsistency spots um in her hair color and this is me pretty much going in with the next bottle for that same bundle um definitely like i said take a loose your bundles cut the clips uh cut the wrap or whatever is on the bundle separate it so that you can get the weft itself as well as the extension thoroughly saturated so that it's fully saturated so that you can get an even distribute of the color um, and that's pretty much what I was doing here. And then once it got fully saturated, like where it was wet, wet, not dry, but wet, wet, um, like as if I had read it up on some water wet, then I would go ahead and put it in a plastic bag, a plastic cap, whatever you got around your house. Um, don't make me know, never mind. Um, but I put it in a plastic cap, tied in the knot so that the heat will help it process a lot quicker. Generally 20 to 25 minutes um, is how long you will let the hair color sit. Um, and I, like I said, I would recommend probably lifting the hair using a 10 or a 20 developer, let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes to lift it to that, that brown stage. Once it got to that brown stage, then I would go in with the honey blonde color to make the color process a lot easier. Um, cause like I said, I had to use two to three bottles, uh, just so that I can ensure that the color was going to come out the way that I needed to come out. Um, I probably could have used less, but like I said, I'm a perfectionist and I ain't want no imperfection in my daughter hair, her back to school hair do because baby, I would have to hear about it. Cause she always going to tell me if I don't get her hair right, if I don't do it right, she going to tell me, okay, she's, she's an honest client that sit in my chair for free 99. She don't pay me not a damn cent to do her hair, but she ain't got to cause I'm her mama. Um, but nonetheless, so that's how I color and achieve that color. So no, the hair does not come in that color. That's a custom color that I did. I do do custom colors, um, on extensions. Um, however, I only color color my hair so i'm not gonna do no guessing with nobody else's bundles that you don't bought from somebody else and you want me to color to make you a wig or whatever the case may be no baby i would not do that because i don't have time to be wasting product on hair that won't color or won't lift um but yeah if you're interested in purchasing hair the link is in my bio on ig